Hey guys, it's Mamet Wonka here with another episode of Mad Matt's Minecraft here in the Wonka Craft server. Um, a lot less angry than last episode because I was probably more angry than I ought to have been. You know, so what? The people do stupid things doesn't mean they're stupid too, right? Sure. Anyway, um, today, uh, we're going to be moving very strongly forward for our, um, what you call it? our solar panel which is good because i'm getting really tired and suddenly i'm having a lot more machines uh that i have to make stuff with um i need to figure out how much mj these require um first uh order of business the copper ingots i got all the copper ingots down uh so we can totally go like that and like that and one, two, three, four, five. We can put five of them away. Because they are not required. We only need seven. Now, um, I had announced previously that my plan, good, good, turn away. My plan had been to take uh to make fossilized bees. That's not right. Resinous bees. There we go. Um, but on further inflection and flipping through NEI, that plan has actually changed. What we're, oh, I think I've got a good breed of ancient down, which is cool because in this side here, this one, uh, we're going to start working on primeval, which we'll need for rocky bees. Um, and I ought to start on forest, but really I need so many princesses and I want to keep one of each type, but I don't think that's gonna happen. I think I'm just gonna have to start doing it. Um, uh, inventory clearing should be something I do soon. Um, we're gonna grab just four of those. We're apparently planting a flower. Um, where are we? Four is a horrible number to grab. We should have grabbed a multiple of three. That's important. Um, quick update over here. Over here, that doesn't change. This is a new tank, multi-tank for seed oil. It goes all the way to the ocean over there, which I think looks kind of cool. Uh, this one doesn't go all the way to the ocean, so I might go and replace the back with stuff, but it's going to be filled with honey. This is my isolator, which is used to isolate things. Effect cancellation serum. Oh, okay. This means that I can apply it to, like, say, lightning bees, and suddenly they have no effect. That's actually really useful, and I really lucked out there. Here's some other effects that I've gotten. Maximum fertility serum. I can apply this to a bee and suddenly it becomes a 4x4, four four, I guess. Rainfall Serum, I guess I can apply this and they're able to fly in the rain. Majestic Species Serum, um, yeah, does what it says on the tin. Um, let's use up a little bit more wood. Uh, we're going to drop our bees in here because we're going to try and actually, we're working on Impregnable. We'll let that go first. Uh, if you have a serum container, you can clear it out using uh, a furnace. You can sterilize them. Um, so I've done that a couple times to get things like pollination and stuff like that that I haven't really cared about. Um, right, but now my inventory is clearer. I don't have any in there. So um, let's go and look at rubber. In any eye, rubber is a useful thing. You can get it through smelting sticky resin or in a powered furnace. Or you can use it in an extractor to get two off of a slime ball. Now, it just so happens that if you take propolis, which I have a lot of, and you place it like so, and you place pollen like so, you get a slime ball, which is equal to two rubber. Which means that that's two of those, and I only need uh, three and a half. So I need a total of three more. Um, slime balls. Or, uh, yeah, to do the recipe three more times. Um, yeah, I am using pollen here to slowly work my way up to an alveary thing. Uh, but that is pretty slow. Um, we'll actually grab that and make another one really quick. And so that's where my rubber is going to come from. I have decided. Let it be written. Let it be done. Um,. Then, oh, you still haven't finished? 
Oh, you turned off, didn't you? Um, this has been kind of annoying here. I need a better MJ infrastructure. That much is certain. Toss that in there and toss this in here. There it goes. Clay dust. There we go. That gives us 16 clay dust, which is the exact amount we need. Now, um, for the parts that aren't going to be exactly done by a bee. Um, but they are extremely based on bee related products. The actual stuff, it's just that, you know, we're going to come over here. And we're going to dump our clay dust into the electrolyzer, which incidentally has no power. Um, grab off our jetpack, start charging. Um, crap. I'm gonna get it, put it up to 256. That ought to be enough for at least the first one. There we go. Um. So let's take a look at recipes. The last one? No, it's never the last one. Um, recipes, recipes, recipes. Oh, 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 oh. Um, oh, it's ten thousand EU. Wow, that'll be really quick. Um, and while flipping through, apparently I can turn uh sugar into carbon and water. That's really cool, actually. Um, because I get a lot of sugar from bees recently. Um, any of these? Oh, I should probably move this somewhere else. Look, another person's online. Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to say say hi. You're rec I'm recording. I just kind of am. Um, uh, I think it was five cells. <laughs> Making my silicone plates. From bees. Hello. Yep, that went really fast. Uh, and it used up all of our um, stuff. Which means I have to find another. Uh, can I reach it? There we go. Apparently, it used up all our tin. But solar cells are nice. We're actually going to use this to cut a little bit of iron out of our uh, production. Because um, one of the things that iron was going to be for was going to be for the uh, advanced circuits. Uh, no, electronic circuits is their name. Um, you better have enough power. Okay, it's just lag. Yeah, lagging, lagging, lagging. There we go. Um, yeah, one of the things was... Uh, uh, sodium cell, water cell, you know, keep those. I have no reason to keep those. Um, unless I wanted to make something right now, but I don't. Because I take the slow path. Um, oh, dang it, and while this was going on, let's get that out of there and don't touch it. Don't touch it. I'm going to throw some slime balls in there. Um, I need to go put the rubber up. Put the rubber up. Put it over here. In, not the table. There we go, rubber. Because the rubber I get shall be pure from the thing. From the bees, there we go. Yep, that's true rubber, straight from a bee's behind. Um, but I think we're pretty much done up in here. Ow, floor, ow, floor. Um, apparently we're going to come and use the last of our blaze rods. Just sad. I'll need to go turn that on for and charge it for a bit. Go AFK, which I do a lot. Over top of it. Um, so I found the uh, should be easy then. Oh wow, that's full power. Excellent. Uh, we're gonna toss our aluminum in there. That's not V aluminum. So we don't trust it. Um, but we didn't really want to put our aluminum in first. We wanted to put our um, silicon plates. But whatever. We'll let it run. Cooking bee byproducts. We still need six more pollen to be able to do 
that uh, to yeah have uh, the be things done. The slime ball's done. Hmm, this should be pretty quick. You know, as things go. Uh, I could take a loan out from other stuff, but I'm not going to. I would really like to be... I really want that solar cell panel. Seriously. Because I have been feeding these machines a lot. And once I get the one solar cell panel, well, you know, once I can make that... Uh, you know, once I can make those resources, it, it's the breeding right now. That's the hard part. Looking for... Um, you know, the stuff. <sighs> Making all the mutations and stuff. I almost have tarnished bees. I'll show you some of the stuff I have. Uh, I've got like a couple of rusty drones, a bauxite drone even, that I guess gets you aluminum. Um, and I've got a couple of tarnished drones and princesses I'm working with. I don't know if they'll be able to breed true this time, but uh, we're working with that. Uh, I'm working on primeval. That's one of my things. I don't need to work with uh, river bees anymore. Uh, they finished their clay dust, uh, making their part in the procedure finished, um, other than, you know, uh, them being kind of cool. Uh, we will shelve them and move their, uh, what you call the things? Their hives, their apiaries? We'll move their apiaries to where they'll be a little bit more useful, um, and being able to get the bees that we need. Uh... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I want to get done here. I want to get done here. There we go. Sweet. So there's my silicon plates for my bee solar panel. There we go. That's the name of the thing I wanted. Um. So yeah, let's go over here. Let's see. Um. Ah, uh, yep, those are where we're working on Ancients. This is where we're working on Noble. Are you part Noble? Because that'd be useful. Yeah, you are. Um, so you're part Noble. And we're going to just grab another Noble drone and drop it in here. What's all in here? Useless? Okay. Uh, my industrious bees do not give me any more delicious, delicious pollen. Um... Tarnished drone and tarnished princess. Problem is, they bred true to a single one, again. Because they do that, though. It's apparently getting better. Um, they are part resilient, though. And that's always a little bit risky. But I think we'll try it. Just to see. Um, okay, then. We're going to grab all these bees. We're actually going to shove them in here. I'm just kind of like stealing this box uh, for them because this is supposed to be for magical bees, which may have been hurting my aura. I'm not quite sure. Um, if you notice, I am wearing my glasses of specialosity um, because there are some questions of aura going on. Uh, made help do me with making some stuff real quick, and uh, I might have killed my flux or wounded my flux or whatever you would call it in the process. So apparently wisps spawn at my base. Um, because, you know, life is never simple. Uh, what you... There we go. Um, and of course, that is a problem. I don't like ever throwing anything away. It's a flaw in my character, I'm sure. Um, yeah, we'll just come back later. Even though I totally have henequin seeds that I've had in my box... They're in my bar for a while. It's still in my bar. We're just going to toss those in here for now. Um, we're going to throw these silicone plates and that insulated copper wire right there. On that and that and that. Uh, I've been eating honeyed slice recently. It's fairly tasty. It turns one, slice, uh, one piece of bread into like four with the cost of only honey. That I totally have. It might have other properties. I don't know. But I like it. I haven't actually had to eat a lot. So I assume that it's pretty good. 
Um, where is a queen? I'm actually going to grab you. We're going to move you over here. So the charmed bees can get their charmed life going again. I'm going to have to check the wiki to find the next step for the charmed bees again. Uh, but they are coming along quite nicely. Uh, 16 isn't quite where I want them to be. 32 would be a lot closer. Um... You can see the tank from there, so you can see how much seed oil I have. I All I know of seed oil being used for is for the alviaries. Not the alviaries, the uh, apiaries. Um, so I don't know how useful it is for me to have a massive supply of it. But I will if I need it, is really the point. Um, Marsh isn't quite what I wanted. Um, hmm, 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 hmm. Check my list again. What do I need? I need a bunch of bees that I can't get. Let me flip to my other tab. I'm totally browsing the internet. Tom, no games tab. Minecraft bee wiki. Um, <laughs> let's see. Can diligent take us anywhere new? Um, <sighs> diligent unweary. What is that unweary? Unweary was gonna go someplace. Uh, leaden and Lustered, maybe? Um, oh, we need to get a good forest bee supply. Dignity was nice enough to bring us some forest bees. Uh, but forest bees, those will be useful. Um, we got, yeah, this one right here. Um, so we'll pop that in. And then we're going to grab a Marble Princess. Just going through and checking to see if there's anything that would be useful otherwise. Uh, <laughs> what is this thing? Wood pulp. Is that helpful at all? Well, this wouldn't be. It's a wooden be dusty comb. Apparently gives me wood pulp. I don't know what wood pulp is, but it sounds like it could be useful. Um, no, it's imperial. There we go. That's unweary. We're going to grab... Uh, no, I need the Unweary Queen. Dang it. This didn't work. Uh, I've got a River Princess in my inventory. That'll work. Combine with the Forest Drone. I don't like it. Combine with the Marble Drone, because I know the Marble Drone will do stuff in this area. Just to figure out... Oh... Biomass. Ah, of course. So, yeah. Bees, bees, bees. Um, I have a lot of the bee pads. I only had like two, and now I have a ton. Um, <laughs> what else? What else? What else is there? Uh, excited bees. Excited bees. We are excited of excited bees. Um, they're out here in the boonies in case they started being violent again. But they have decided not to do that with fairly solid regularity uh, so we're actually gonna break that and bring them back home i don't know if they still need redstone we'll bring it anyway oh there's some weird rocking going on um which one's your home there's your home go away i wonder if they pollinate redstone if i just had redstone dust on the floor if it would grow could be, but I totally have enough redstone. Uh, I don't know how much of it was from it, but I've definitely gotten at least two off of it, which is what I needed. So, really the big thing I'm working on, trying to get, is the uh, tarnished drone. Uh, tarnished bees. I want to get that bred true, so I can start getting tin. Once I start getting tin, uh, the next step is to combine, you know, get a, uh, a bronze bee. By combining the tin and the uh, copper bees. And then from there, I think it can turn it to a golden bee. I do think I need to grab something and make it into a silvered bee. But I don't know what. I think that's the unwearied bee, actually. So, yeah. That's what I'm working with. Just working on the bees. Trying to get them, you know, uh, reliable. 
what I need to do is uh, come over here to my isolator. I need to actually come play with some more of these machines. Uh, so next episode, you'll see a lot more machines. Oh, look, a thing. Effect cancellation. That's the one we saw earlier. Um, but yeah, it'd be really great if I could get a one by one B serum so I could inject the B and just be able to pump it constantly out of a chest without worrying about drone buildup. Um, in that case, I could then make an automated B resource farm where I can just suddenly say, I need a bunch of copper and hit stuff on. And then these bees would be super bees that would be times one, times one, and then they would be super fast and they would have long lives and they would just be able to churn out a lot of stuff. Uh, that's the goal that I want to get to. Have those actually, if I could have those working underground um, and not need sunlight, you know, make them cave bees that can work in the rain, that can work at night, uh, super long lives, able to work anywhere. Yeah, that would be the goal. Um, and then I would have to find a place to put them and have them dump all their stuff and start automating the bees. That would be the best part. So we will get to that eventually. But until then, I think that's going to be it for this episode. So you guys stay online. And I will see you next time. Peace out.